All right, we're back out here at uh, Kit's house. Uh, let's see, today is Saturday. It was the last Saturday that we got finished hanging and we got it taped for the first one on Sunday. Couldn't make it back all week long, so we came out here yesterday. Uh, we put the second coat on the flats and butt joints, and Brandon did the nails again. Uh, so it's really, I don't have much to show you. Everything looks the same. It's just got a second coat of mud on it. Uh, we had a real bad like hump in the ceiling right there where that wall was taken out, and uh, there's no joist in there. Um, might have been a good idea to tear some rock out and put a joist up right there, but I, I think it's going to be okay. We've hung worse. So we took the 40 inch knife yesterday and ran that with a lot of mud. I'm glad it's dry. I was afraid it wasn't going to be dry, but uh, really, these are dry. I ran the bead yesterday too. Um, so I don't have a lot to show you. So. I say everything still looks exactly the same. It's just uh, got more mud on it now. <laughs> so uh, I'm probably not going to do any workflow here. Um, I, I, honestly, it's it's about three o'clock I think on Saturday, and I'm, we've been hanging a big job all week that you have already seen at this point. The uh, attorney's office and. Uh, I'm about beat. Uh, unfortunately, I was, I'd like to take a day off tomorrow, but we need to get another coat on this because if we can get the last coat on this tomorrow, then oh, next weekend we can sand and have it primed. So that's what we're shooting for. So anyway, I'm gonna start getting stuff unloaded and <clears throat> we're gonna get in here and run angles and beat again. And uh, that's probably all we'll do today because we can do the flats and butt joints tomorrow. <clears throat> So uh, anyway, I'll catch you up on this one later. All right, what's up guys? Uh, finally feel like we're making some progress here. Uh, it's kind of dark, it's storming. Every time we come up here to work, it storms. But uh, we got almost everything primed. Uh, we're just, when we get ready to spray this or do the ceilings, I'm gonna just spray these closets white. So. Oh, this is front bedroom here is primed. These floors were a nightmare to scrape yesterday. Brennan and Hunter spent a long time on these floors because all that old carpet backing that was glued down had to come up. Uh, got this back room back here. It's primed and ready to go. Same thing with that closet. I'll just come in here and spray white and only when we do the ceilings. Uh, bathroom. It's really kind of damn in here, but. This wall we didn't do because I screwed up. <laughs> uh, well, I guess you'll be able to see this. But, uh, if you remember way back, on uh, way back on the first uh, butt joint video that I did where I used a big knife, I said, don't ever forget to wipe one down. I guess what I did yeah, the other day. So this is still wet. We'll just let it, we'll let it dry and then I'll just sand it, sand it out. We may have to skim it again and then we'll catch this wall up. But anyway, uh, we got the laundry room is primed. Left that wall off. We got to put a. Uh, <clears throat> we're gonna put a remodel box in over there for their uh, Ethernet cables there, and uh, I just didn't feel like rolling it. We'll just catch that up when we <clears throat> come back in and do this other wall. Bedroom, master bedroom is primed. bath we just did this so you can still I don't know how well it'll show up on that video but 
it's still drying so you can still see through it. And then I just sprayed over all this patchwork in here. We will, I don't know where this video will come out, but uh, we're working on the attorney's office right now. You should have already seen that one by the time this comes out. I'm almost positive of that. So. Uh, we just got finished hanging it the other day, packing all the crates. And so we gotta run back out there. We'll be there all week. I mean, Hunter's going back to school, so it's just me and Brandon. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be a job for both of us to tape that big old thing. So uh, I'm figuring, I'm figuring we'll be there probably three days taping. We may be able to get it done in two. Uh, just depending on how it goes. But, uh, anyway, I don't see us getting back out here this week. I think it's gonna be next weekend before we can get back out here. And, uh, next step, all these floors here, we're gonna have to put a quarter inch glue on down on top of these to match the rest of the, this hat, the, this, the, to match the rest of this. So we tried taking this piece up and seeing if we could take all that up, but it doesn't match. And it's gonna be cheaper in the long run just to buy a Luan for the, it'll be the two bedrooms and the bath in this little area here that it'll just be cheaper to do that than it would be to pull all this up and then recover all of it. So we'll put the Luan down next weekend. Uh, I'm not sure if they got their floor picked out, but then we'll put the floor, pick the, put the floor down and then get in here and start hanging trim and they're, they're getting closer. So anyway, we're gonna get out of here. I got another little job to stop at. It's freaking Sunday. And I think it's like three o'clock or something like that. Uh, I'm about ready to get to the house. Been a long, long week. So anyway, I will catch you guys up on this one next time.